population of 1.2 million, and of these children, 42% are not attending school. We've just heard of the story of an Azizi girl in Iraq. What we're seeing is even though the immediate threat is over for them, they are not being accepted back into their communities. The stigmatization is horrific. So these girls have not only suffered appalling abuse, they've now lost their families, their culture, their connections. So this abuse continues. Iraq is also one of the most vulnerable countries in the world to climate breakdown. It's currently being affected by soaring temperatures, um, loss of water, and intensified droughts. And this insufficient water is directly